Assalamu alaikum, my dear learners. I'm Imrul Hassan, lecturer in English of Government Musical College. For COVID-19, we cannot attend our usual class, and this is why we take online classes. My dear learners of newly admitted in class 11 of general and BM. Today I would like to take a class on on Nelson Mandela of a fighter from a fighter to president. I think you have already bought this book, bought the new book. This book, your textbook, English textbook for class 11 and 12, both general and BM section. Uh, you have, I think you have already bought this book and you enjoying this book as present at the lesser time because you do you need to come in college to college. That's why you are staying at home and read this book yourself. Today, let's our class, let's have our class. Open your book at page number seven. Page number seven. Nelson Mandela from Apartheid Fighter to President. Nelson Mandela from Apartheid Fighter to President. This topic has been taken from Unit 1, Lesson 2, page number 7 of your book, your new book, English new book. Unit 1, Lesson 2. Before starting our class, let's have some keywords. That's vocabulary. It may be it may be new to you. That's why I'm going to uh, tell the meaning of these words, books, vocabularies. The first is apartheid. Apartheid. What does mean apartheid? Apartheid means racism or discrimination. Next, adore. Adore means admire, admire, admire. Another one is charisma. Charisma means personality, personality. The other one is chasm. Chasm means gap or disunion or rift. Another is Ambali. Ambali means represent, personify, personify. And the last one is emancipation. Emancipation means liberation or freedom. Freedom. Now, please, my dear learners, open your book at page number seven. Nelson Mandela. Now read this passage yourself. I'm reading out for yourself the first para. This 15 December 2013, Johannesburg, Reuters. Nelson Mandela guided South Africa from the shackles of apartheid to a multiracial democracy as an icon of peace and reconciliation who came to Amberley the struggle for justice around the world. Imprisoned for nearly three decades for his fight against the white majority rule, Mandela never lost his resolve to fight for his people's emancipation. He was determined to bring down a third while avoiding a civil war. His prestige and charisma helped him win the support of the world. I hate race 
discrimination most intensely and in all its manifestations. I've felt it all during my life and fight it now and will do so until the end of my days. Mandela said in his acceptance speech on becoming South Africa's first black president in 1994. The time for the healing of the world has come. The move when to bring the chasms divine us has come. Now read the rest of this passage yourself and try to comprehend the meaning of the passage for five minutes. For five minutes, the rest of the passage. Okay, I think you have read, you have read this passage yourself. Now I would like to ask you some question and answer the question yourself. First, let me erase the white book. Some questions based on your reading, you have to answer this question. The first one is Who was Nansan Mandala? Who was Nansan Mandala? Second, Why was he famous for? Why he famous for? Number three, how many years? He was imprisoned. Before why did he become? the president of South Africa. The four questions. Answer this question. Clear? Okay, let me Make answer for you. Who was Nelson Mandela? Nelson Mandela was the first president of South Africa. He has fought for the racism against the racism and for apartheid. Number two, why was he famous for? Why Nelson Mandela famous for? Why he was famous? Nelson Mandela was famous for his resolve to fight against the page. Number three, how many years he was imprisoned? How many years 
He was behind the bars. Nelson Mandela was imprisoned for about three decades. That means decades mean ten years. That means he was nearly thirty years imprisoned. Number four. When did he become the president of South Africa? When did he become the first president of South Africa? Nelson Mandela became the first black president of South Africa in 1949. Mandela learners, I hope you have understood this passage and in the next class we will appear, I will appear before you with another topic on this passage that is flow chart. How to make flow chart on uh, how to make chart on a basis. And I think it would be better for you to uh, to have this basis as a flow chart as a basis. In the next class, I will appear before you how to make a flow search on this basis. My advice to you, stay at home and keep learning. Don't stop your studies. And maintain all the hygiene rules. When you come in your, to your room, wash your hands for 20 seconds with sanitizer and sanitizer and we will meet after the danger time will provide pass we will meet face to face thank you all for today assalamu alaikum